Welcome to COVID Q&A, your questions, our answers. At the HSC community, comprised of staff, faculty, students, and community members, slowly begins its return to normal operations, it's important we continue to educate ourselves about COVID-19. Today, I'm sitting down with Dr. Dale Bratzler, who is a faculty member in both the Hudson College of Public Health and the College of Medicine, and was recently named the Chief COVID Officer for the university. Dr. Bratzler will be answering a frequently asked question. Thank you, it's my pleasure to be here. Well, we're excited to have you and we're thankful for your time. Dr. Bratzler, today's question is, I've read that chlorine kills the virus that causes COVID-19. Does that mean it's safe to go into the neighborhood pool? Yeah, so the CDC has published guidance here about um, public swimming pools and, and home swimming pools. The important things to remember is that properly maintained swimming pools uh, that have proper levels of chlorine or bromine uh, in them do kill the virus, so the water kills the virus, and there's no evidence that the virus is transmitted through the water, through water systems, or other things. That said, if you're going into a swimming pool, particularly if you're going to be close to other people where it's a large crowd and you cannot maintain social distancing, there is some risk of transmission of COVID-19 from person to person because most people in a pool will not have a mask on. And remember that the principal mechanism by which COVID-19 transmits from person to person is through respiratory droplets or aerosols that one person lets out of their mouth and another person breathes in. So it's important if you're going to participate in swimming pool activities to try to maintain social distancing as much as you possibly can. Uh, we recommend that uh, if you're out of the pool on the side that you wear a mask if possible. And then remember that um, common high touch surfaces like railings or if there are common uh, public bathrooms or other things that may be there, you need to remember that there could be contaminated surfaces, so you need to do frequent hand hygiene uh, anytime you're outside of the pool. Awesome. So would you agree the main takeaway here is that regardless if you're at the pool, protocol such as social distancing, masking, and hand washing still should be taking place? Yeah, certainly if you're out of the water, you can't usually wear a mask in the water itself, but certainly if you're out of the pool, uh, in common areas, we, we would still recommend that you wear a mask, particularly if you can't social distance. If you're out there by yourself, then you're safe. But if you're around a lot of other people and you can't maintain that six feet of physical distancing, then I would recommend that you wear a mask. Well, thank you for sharing, Dr. Bratzler, and thank you all for tuning in to this week's COVID Q&A.